Good afternoon, I'm James Crumble. That breaking news, Lower Paxton Township Police giving an update on the investigation into the death of Central Dolphin High School student Justin Johnson. Our Sarah Wilson is there. She is live with the very latest. I'll have news coming out of this, Sarah. James, you're absolutely correct. Police just speaking to us moments ago, calling this an ongoing and complex investigation. They say it started when Justin was involved in a tag game leading up to his death. This is video you're looking at provided by Lower Paxton Police. You can see kids mostly at school going around trying to tag each other. Justin is in one of these videos. This comes just days after a family attorney said the game senior assassin may have played a role in Justin's death. Police say there was a snap Snapchat trend Justin was in that was started for this game. The rules they say require three to five people to witness the tag or catch it on video. And that is why police believe one of the boys who was caught on that front door security footage said get this on video. Of course, we know this all started when four teens came up to the Johnson's front door multiple times that Friday evening. When the family's lawyer spoke Wednesday, he said he believed there may have been a weapon involved. Police speaking to that moments ago. At 823, three friends are seen on the video knocking on Justin's door. And at that particular time, there's been discussion out and you've seen the video. One male has this water gun, as you can see, a white and green water gun. And after Justin was chased, the family attorney says that is when Justin went back inside and had called his dad, telling him that he was having trouble breathing. When his dad came home about 45 minutes later, he found Justin unconscious. He had tried to do CPR. Unfortunately, it was too late. Now, the coroner did rule this death as natural and caused by complications from sickle cell disease, as well as another heart condition. James, we're going to have a lot more on this coming up in our next half hour, as well as at five and six tonight. And Sarah, I know a lot of this press conference centered on this game that these students were playing. Did the police have any indication that Justin was a willing participant in the game? James, that's one of the things that we're still trying to figure out. Police had mentioned that there was some sort of contract apparently involved in this that perhaps other students were taking part in as well. Whether Justin was involved in that, we're still trying to figure that out. But again, he was in a Snapchat thread regarding this game, which perhaps maybe did show he was a willing participant. But again, James, still something we're trying to figure out. All right, Sarah Wilson, you'll stay on this story. We'll see you coming up in our next half hour. Thank you so much. And we